A week after an alleged DUI crash left four people dead, volunteers are hoping to make the road where it happened a little bit safer. Three of the victims were UC Davis students. Now the Aggie community on that campus is working to make sure that no other lives are lost. Fox 40's Carmen Dickerson joining us live from UC Davis after speaking with those that are behind that effort. Carmen. Well, unfortunately, when things like this happen, it can make people feel helpless, hopeless. And this was about some students really feeling like they wanted to do something, anything to make a change. There was not one, but two alleged drunk drivers responsible for a crash early Friday morning, which left four people dead and four cars crashed along Highway 99 near Manteca. Three of the victims were UC Davis students who, according to investigators, were not suspected of being under the influence. Three UC Davis students' lives were actually taken uh, by a traffic accident. Which prompted others with ties to the university to act. Sometimes situations like this, it can seem so surreal, especially when it's another student. Jonathan Fernandez, a UC Davis alum and volunteer with SF Zion Church, says he and his fellow volunteers wanted to do something to make roads safer. So we're, our heart is really just to help community members become more aware of ways that we can drive more safely. So they went out and purchased hands-free cell phone holders, windshield cleaners, and tire pressure checkers, small items they hope can make a big difference. Students and parents, they probably already know about We Should Drive Safe, but now what's more important is turning that knowledge into action, into habits. And so I asked him what kind of response he got from the community. We were able to see him have some one-on-one -on -one interactions with people. And he said he spoke with upwards of a dozen people just trying to get the word out. And that's in addition to his colleagues that were out on campus handing out flyers, letting them know about the free items available. And he said really they'll consider it a win if even one person changes their behavior. Reporting from UC Davis, I'm Karma Dickerson, Fox 40 News.